Hey, what's up, guys? V here. Hey, this is gonna run a little long. Zomi mini tabletop tripod. I showed an unboxing to set up what's in the box, you know, all that stuff. I also show a setup on the DSLR and on your um, phone. So go ahead and check it out. Let me shut up. Hey, what is up, guys? V, v Worldwide here. Today we are unboxing the Zomi tabletop tripod. I'm looking for another tripod to do some, um, catch some tabletop things. I have a tripod um, right now. It's just uh, too big. So I'm going to be using this one to put on my desk so I can get a little closer up for you guys on these, some of these products. But there it is. So let's bust it open and see what we got. I did get this off of Amazon. Um, <clears throat> go ahead and send up, put a link to the description at the bottom. Remember to like, comment, and it helps me get you more videos out. So, got the box. Anything else now? Nope. Set that to the side here. I'm in this nice bag. Well, not nice, but it's, I mean, it's cool. Drawstring here. Let's open that. No, I do. I was shooting with a um, smaller tripod at first. It was like one of the little uh, adjustable, and you know where you can put them around poles. You could. They were really flexible. It just wasn't sturdy enough. And I did have a. Um, I had a video on that one also. I'll put a uh, card up at the top of the screen. You can check that out if you want to. It just wasn't for me. But I did use the phone mount from that one on my Sony tripod that I have, and I also have a uh, link for that one, and I'll put that up also. So we're getting the bag here. Here's a little, uh, it's pretty nice. Let's see here. All right, so, got the manual, little Allen wrench there. Oh, and I even, see they put in a, um, it's like a phone adapter on it. Also, if you want to use it with your phone, it should come out and be cool too. So there, adjustable tripod mount there. What else we got? Oh, it just goes over the body here. So there we go. It's pretty cool. There we go. There. Adjust. It's like the legs adjust here. Oh, this gets up pretty far. Let me hit another angle and I'm gonna, um, I'll widen the angle for you so you can see this up close. A ball head mount there. Let's get out a little bit. See that? A little level there. And this actually tightens that so it won't flop around on you. So now it's tight. What else do we have here? A little in this here. Your level comes out and that loosens this part up here. Need to move that around. Okay, some more Zomi tags here. Let's see what these do. So you can actually pull, slide those out also, so you can move the legs. Just pop it back in if you want to lock it in place. Same thing with that one. Like you're going to adjust the view here. Let me, um, so if you want to get another different angle shot, put it like that. Put it sideways so you can see that. 
mount your camera here. I'm gonna mount the um, I'm gonna mount my Note 9 to it now since I'm not using it to film it right now. I'm gonna do that, and I will be right back. Okay, so I grab my Note 9. Let's see if this gets, yeah, it fits. It's a big phone, so there you go. It's probably pretty much gonna fit anything that you have. There, little mount there. Let's um, get this mounted on. So we just screw this all the way out. This pops off. Got a little locking key under there so you can move the mount around. So we take that, that part, you could either mount it here or you can mount it here. Let's do this one here, let's check this out. So you just take the bottom of it there and kind of twist that on. And you have the mount, mount it there, there. Alright. And we're going to place it back on like this here. Shit. Slide this into place. Just like that. And then we just tighten this back down here. We got it locked, and there we are. And you can move this around if you need to. Get some good shots with it. Like so. And I have that laying down, so if we want to stand it up, push those legs in, pop the uh, locks down. That is. Stand it up just like that. Let me go ahead and get that up for you a little bit. There you go. Just like so. Spin that around. Clamps are pretty tight on there. And spin that. And again, you could tighten that with this here. You can tighten the ball head up. So you can, that rotates. You want to tighten that, you just tighten it there. Mm -hmm. And also, if you spin this around, it tightens. So it loosens that way and tightens this way. And then I want to move that again. So, so there we go. And I'll get a shot with the um, my P900 also mounted to this. And just give me a second, and I will stand this on the floor and let you take a look at it. Actually, let me. I'm gonna get a um, wider shot on the table. It may work out. So the things you can do with this are, I mean, they're just endless. Look at this. So. I got the legs all the way spread there, give you a little more stability. The camera, the P900 that I have, so you'll see it in a minute, um, it'll easily hold that up. Now once you get a little taller, and I would suggest for the DSLRs that you make it a little wider at the base, I mean you guys probably know that already, but there's that, and also, Give me a moment here. I'm gonna adjust it. You can actually detach this and flip this to the bottom and have some, here, I'll show you in a second. Hold on. So, here we go. This video is getting longer than I thought it should be. So, you can actually unscrew this part here. This is that housing right there. Move my hand. You take that off. Flip this, take this, tighten this part here, and you can flip this around and put it like that. Bring the legs down. I'm going to extend the legs real quick here. Mount this underneath here. Uh -oh. 
just like that. Get some different type shots here. Let me pick this up here. Just like that. And you can mount everything here. And there you go. And you just, these here, you just pull them up and out. And you can fold them back and lay it back like that. Now I'm going to adjust the height here and show you it um, at a higher angle. Be right. Two, three, four sections. So this section comes out of the body here. And this comes out of there, and you know how that goes. So there you go. P900. Again, this is a heavy camera, so I mean, it's holding it up pretty good. You just got to make sure you tighten your bolts down, tighten everything down. And there you have it. That is the Zomi Tabletop Tripod. Um, again, I'll put a link in the description below. Please like, comment, subscribe to my channel. This is V. I am out.